It cold over the next few days. Alexis Padilla live in Storm Tracker 3 tonight. Alexis, how's it looking? Jeff, we're currently heading westbound on Kellogg and compared to earlier today, conditions are looking fairly well, although some spots do look a little wet. I'm going to give you a look right here and that means it could be slick, but these can change quickly. These conditions once that flash freeze comes in traffic, not too terrible right now. People taking it slow, but KHP is encouraging people to stay off the roads and stay at home once that freeze comes. If you do not need to drive do not do so but if you have to make sure you're prepared have your gas tank at least halfway full so if you get stranded you can stay as warm for as long as possible pack an emergency kit filled with jumper cables a cell phone charger blanket snacks and water and if you do end up broke down somewhere troopers stress do not get out of your car not in that dangerous dangerous very dangerous uh, uh wind chill and, and temperatures because it will not take long um, for hypothermia to set in. And sadly, we have all worked those type of things and really don't want to do that ever again. KHP currently has a 24 hour frost patrol in place, which means troopers will be driving back and forth certain areas looking for people in need of help. If you do get stranded, you can call star 47 or 911 for help. Here for you in Storm Tracker 3, Alexis Padilla, KSN News 3. Back to you, Jeff. All right, uh, Alexis, thank you.